Alrighty, in this video I'll be going after Gemini Man. And I know I just got this spark shot, but I'm really not going to use it here in Gemini Man stage. It's not a very good stage to use the spark shot. The spark shock basically freezes enemies in place. I guess that could be useful, but this is mostly a stage where you'll be fighting enemies. Here we have the evil penguins, which throw eggs at you. And we have the dragonflies. Now, when a dragonfly appears, just stand in space. That is, stand in place. That's what I meant to say. And the dragonfly will just try to sneak up behind you. Like this. I stand in place, then I turn around and kill the dragonfly. Stand in place, turn around, kill the dragonfly. Alternately, you could try to jump over the dragonfly. That's more dangerous. And it's harder to do, so I just avoid it. And here we go. Dropping down a screen because, well, you have to drop down a screen. Here's an enemy. You can slide under the enemy or use charge shots to defeat the enemy. Either way, get down to the next screen, which is this one right over here. And basically, you just have to do jumps while looking out for those dragonflies. The dragonflies are just there to slow you down in case you're one of those people who want to go through this stage quickly. Just take a jump, wait for the dragonfly to appear, then kill the dragonfly, and then do your next jump. Uh-oh, penguin, penguin! Oh man, I don't like those penguins. Here's an enemy. Well, I guess you really didn't get to see that enemy. Okay, forget that enemy. And here's the part of the stage where you get to destroy eggs. They're like alien egg things, and then aliens pop out of them. And you need to shoot them. And I'm going to go through this portion of the stage in fast-forward mode. It's not too much of a challenge here, you just want to destroy these evil eggs while going through the stage. Here, just destroy more of the eggs. Yeah, not much to say, just go through this area destroying all of the eggs. Here's where things get different have a pit of spikes. Destroy all the eggs, and then jump over the pit of spikes. That was simple enough. Here you want to destroy the eggs on top, and then jump on the other eggs to get over this particular pit of spikes. Once that's done, just keep on destroying eggs and then go all the way to the right to the ladder, and then climb up the ladder. I wasted a lot of time on these eggs because I was trying to get power-ups because I needed more health. And here are the enemies, which I was trying to tell you about earlier. You can only hit them when they're jumping. I think that's why these enemies are tricky. I could be wrong, and I could be remembering it incorrectly. And as you saw just there, the easy way to get through these eggs is with a charge shot. It destroys multiple eggs at once, and you don't have to fight off the evil aliens. So here we have the penguins. You want to shoot the thing at the top while shooting the penguins on the bottom. So basically shoot the penguins on the bottom and occasionally jump and hit the thing on top. Eventually, it will be destroyed. A lot of people like this because you can just stand still and kill all the baby penguins in order to get a lot of power-ups. But you just went through the area with all the eggs, so you should have a lot of power-ups just from that. And here, don't jump up. If you jumped up, the dragonfly would have hit you while flying to the right. That's just a tricky spot with the dragonflies, and here's another penguin. 
Get this dragonfly here. Alright, I'm doing well. Ooh, ah, uh, poor Mega Man. And this is a good area for grinding for power-ups. If you were hurt by the penguins like I was, all you have to do is walk left and right around this area to trigger a bunch of dragonflies. One dragonfly is to the right, and one dragonfly is to the left. So just go left and right, back and forth between the dragonflies, and kill them to get a bunch of health power-ups. However, it took me about three minutes to get all the way filled up, so... I'm not entirely sure it's worth the time investment. Alright, here we go, more of those eggs. Easily destroyed with a charge shot. And I think we have more jumping and the dragonflies. Okay. Alright, jump. Wait for the dragonfly and kill it before making the next jump. Kill the dragonfly before making the next jump. Uh oh, enemy. Okay, that's tricky. And this is kind of tricky. In this area, you want to charge up a shot and then jump to the right and fire the shot at the dragonfly. Otherwise, what's going to happen is what happened here. The dragonfly hit me while it was going to the left. And we're here at the end of the stage. Time for the fight against Gemini Man. Gemini Man splits up into two pieces, which makes it a tricky battle. And as you'll notice, Gemini Man fires whenever you fire a single shot. See, I'm not firing any shots, and there I was firing a lot of shots, and so we stopped and fired a lot of shots. So you can kind of control the battle in that whenever you fire a single shot, Gemini Man will fire a single shot, so you can control whenever Gemini Man shoots at you. It's recommended that you use charge shots and then just stay here in the middle and fire at Gemini Man. Okay, when Gemini Man is at half health, the two halves recombined and you just have to fire at him while dodging the Gemini laser. Okay, that was pretty simple. An easy boss battle, and as a reward, we get the Gemini Laser! The Gemini Laser is clearly much better than the Spark Shot. Although, to be quite honest, I don't think I'll use either of them in the next video.